Yo! Plat, plat! Y'all know the name, man. Platinum Zeke back with another video. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. And I know you missed me. 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 All right, let's get into the video, guys. Basically, there are two types of people in this world. Those who pretend and those who don't pretend. Pretending means to act like something is the case when it really isn't the case, if you know what I'm saying. There's a lot of people like that out here. And that also makes you a liar. And the worst thing you can be is a liar. You don't want to be a liar. And the worst person you can lie to is yourself. You can lie to everybody else and maybe get away with it. But you will never be able to lie and get away with it to yourself. You will never be able to lie to yourself because you will know the truth. Imagine telling yourself a lie and then conveniently believing that lie while it's a bunch of up. It's a, it's a little voice in your head telling you the truth and you know that all these lies are being said to cover up that little voice telling you the truth. So let's talk about it. So basically the question I'll be answering today is, how did I become consistent in the weight room? Voila, where am I at? The weight room, the weight room, okay? The weight room, where I got this at, okay? So look, okay, so the first thing that I had to do was I had to convince myself that this is exactly what I wanted to devote my time to, which wasn't really hard to do. I mean, look at, look at how I looked. It wasn't hard to devote because why do I want to like that? You know what I'm saying? Guys, I had to understand that fitness was my focus and everything else was a distraction. Say it with me. Come in close, guys. Come in close. Come in close. Distraction. So first, I just want everybody to ask themselves, is this what I want to do? And if your answer is yes, then it's time for you to swear in and devote and commit and dedicate. All right, next, I obtained structure and organization. Not everybody likes planning and making schedules, but it is a proven fact that structure has a better chance of a successful outcome than no structure. That is proven scientific, all that, and just internal. You know that. You know that if you knew what you had to do, you'll do it. But if you don't know what you have to do, you, fur you then further have to step back, figure out what you have to do, and then step forward and do it, rather than just waking up and with that first step forward, hey, we're about to get to it, we get into it, you know what I'm saying? I created my first workout plan when I was 16, guys. It wasn't hard for me. All it took was for me to sit down and figure out what days I wanted to train and what days I wanted to train what muscle, what part of my body. That's all it took for me to take, sit down, take that time and construct that schedule that was right for me. That's all it took. And after that, things started to roll smoothly. Once I had a set in stone schedule, all I had to do was wake up and do what my schedule told me to do. There would be no, no types of stops, nothing, no pauses. I would wake up and do exactly what my schedule told me to do. No dilemma. You see way too many people going to the gym blindly or going to the gym and while they're at the gym, looking up workouts while they're at the gym to train what they want to train. You're just making it hard for yourself, I promise. If you want to be consistent, get some structure, make a plan, learn how to make yourself a schedule. That will be a video of mine, learning how to create a workout plan. It's not hard, but I can help you guys out. But if you want to be consistent, you need to get some structure. I mean, hey, I'm really living proof of the things I say. I'm telling y'all about the things I did to get where I'm at because I obviously don't look the same as I did three years ago. So I don't just get on the camera and lie. I get on the camera and just tell you guys everything I did so you could use it to help yourself. I'm only here to help, guys. That's why you're subscribed to the channel. All right. Another thing I had to do to become one with the gym, to become consistent, I had to... Uh, Oh, All right, no, seriously. Uh, when I realized, when I realized I wanted to become one with the gym, I had to cut the BS. 
By BS, I mean procrastination. I had to give it up. Procrastination is a hell of a drug, but I had to go sober. I had to make it my routine and habit to work out on my scheduled days and understand that I will eventually get used to it. Studies show that it takes 21 to 90 days to form a new habit. I really hope I didn't make that sound hard. But hey, you can do it. I started seeing results in the gym just one month after working out, working hard, working right. I started seeing results in the gym. One month. Don't believe me? Hopefully that motivates you to, you know, get to it. All right, guys. So all in all, let me just say something to y'all. I want, I want y'all to sit back and think now. You know that dream body that we all have it stored in our head that seems so easy to get, but somehow you just don't have it. Imagine if you did have it. Do you know how happy and proud you'll be of yourself? This is where I come to the most important part about being consistent. Guys, I had to understand that I had to put the gym and fitness over everything extra. I had to put the gym over everything. You have to sacrifice fun time for gym time until the sacrifice doesn't even feel like a sacrifice anymore. It's just a part of your lifestyle. That's just how it's going to have to be if you want to maintain consistency, obtain consistency if you're chasing consistency. If you practice that, you'll be shocked in how consistent and driven you become. 2020 studies show that people with regular exercise schedules have way more days where they feel good than people who don't. With that being said, imagine having your dream body or some form of your dream body a long plus sign a regular workout schedule. Regular exercise schedule. I just want to let that sink in. If you just listen to what I said about happiness and the studies that showed, imagine having the schedule plus your dream body. Once, you're, once you maintain consistency and you start to see these results, then you will maintain and obtain that regular workout schedule and you will be getting closer and closer to your dream body by the day. So just imagine the happiness and the comfort, you know, non-depression, excited, driven, energetic. To get, to get something out of it, you got to put something into it, guys. You can't just sit back and think about it. Guys, if you incorporate those four things into your lifestyle, you will find yourself being more consistent and driven in no time. Trust me, I promise, guys, I wouldn't sit on here and lie to you guys. I want you guys to follow me. So with that being said, subscribe to the channel, Platinum Zeke. Go subscribe to my vlog channel because I'm going to be loading that channel up soon with lit content. I swear to you guys, it's, it's going up, man. Summertime is upon us. It's coming. We, we're in March right now. Summertime is coming up, guys. We're going we're gonna to really grow the, brand, grow the brand this year. So subscribe to this channel. There's so much, so much stuff coming. You know, I'm trying to adjust to my schedules. If you guys didn't know, I'm actually injured, out, out with an injury for basketball season right now. So a lot of stuff is going on right now, but I'm going to keep uploading for you guys. Uh, just make sure you guys press subscribe for me. Drop a like on this video. Comment any questions you have. Maybe I'll turn that into a video or I'll hit you back individually. And as always, my social medias are at the bottom of the video. And you guys know how I end all of my videos. I put that light skin, yellow bicep up. I'm not holding the camera this time, so I'm going to have to come to y'all. But I just want y'all to get a great view. You know, you got the... And then the... You know, look like a potato. Press subscribe, baby. Ah! 2020... 2020 studies show that people who have 2020 2020 study